What's up everyone? Just got home from work so I'm about to let the flyers out. So I'm gonna lock up all the breeders and I let all the flyers out and I'm gonna see if I can give you guys a quick video of how they're doing in the air. Like I said before, the, their kidding isn't that great just because they've been on lockdown for the whole winter. But I'm gonna go ahead and get that for you guys and we will go from there. So stay tuned guys. So I did swing by John Johnson's house after work to pick up a extra cock bird. I'm planning to breed this bird with one of the hens in the loft. That hen is actually paired up with the Mason cock bird right now and they actually have two eggs so I don't know if I'm planning to keep those eggs or if I'm just gonna throw those eggs away, split up the pair and put this cock with that hen. Uh, one of the club members is planning to pick up some Mason hen birds so I might end up giving him that cock uh, to uh, take and go breed some more mason birds so if that does happen I'm gonna split that pair up and most likely I'm gonna pair up this blue bar with that hen. The hen is a um, dark check white flight so um, we'll see what happens here in a few weeks but for now I guess this cock is gonna stay single until I figure out what I'm planning to do with it. Pretty nice cock bird. I believe this is a bird that John loaned out to one of his um, friends and I'm basically just borrowing it for now and after I'm done depending if John wants it back or not I'll give it back to him. If he doesn't want it back then I'll probably just end up keeping it and just making it a breeder. But it's a good looking blue bar. Whoever had it before took really good care of it so it's in really good shape. So all the flowers are still flying so I'm going to let them go ahead and do their thing. I'm going to go ahead and feed all the young birds before they end up coming back and they want to eat too. But there is a young bird missing. Uh, one of the Higgins slash Norm Reed stuff. Uh, for some reason those birds mature really fast and that bird is actually already flying and trying to kit with the older birds. So I'm just going to go ahead and let that bird do his thing. Eventually this guy right here too will eventually want to take off and start flying but for now uh, it's not a big deal like I said it's still really young so I don't really want to risk them getting lost anyways so if they don't want to fly that's all on them but let them go ahead and eat the birds are going crazy right now eating so I'm gonna let them eat first and after they're done eating I'll give you guys a run around of what's going on inside the loft so stay tuned guys Alright so the birds are done eating and they're much more calm so I'm going to go ahead and give you guys the run around of what is going on in the loft right now. So we do have new eggs in the loft. They actually belong to the mason cockbird right here and one of the double J hens. 
I wasn't planning to breed them together, but they both were single and they, I guess they ended up clicking together and now they're a pair and they have a set of eggs. I'll probably check these eggs in a couple of days here to see if they're fertile or not. I'm thinking they are fertile, but with the cockbird being so old, you never know. But I'll check these eggs in a couple of days and see uh, if the eggs are fertile or not. So the only other pair in here that has eggs is the Higgins stuff. Their eggs are due to hatch sometime next week. I have to go double check the calendar, but I'm pretty sure it's sometime next week. It'll be interesting to see what colors they are this time. I know the very first time they had babies for me, uh, one of them was a black white flight, one of them was a blue check white flight. The second set, both of them were red checks, but one of them had white flights. So we'll see what they have this time when their babies hatch, if their babies hatch and if they survive. So that's pretty much all the new updates for now. Like I said before, I'm just waiting for all the birds to lay eggs. That's pretty much what I've been waiting for for maybe the past uh, three, four weeks. So I'm hoping that that happens soon. I have been adding some calcium to the birds diet because I was told that maybe they're lacking calcium. That might be the reason why they're not laying eggs. But we will see if the added calcium to their diet will help them lay eggs soon or not. Uh, probably do another update video on maybe a couple days. Thanks for watching everyone. If you like my videos, give me a thumbs up. If you aren't subscribed, go ahead and click that subscribe button. Thanks for watching and I'll check you guys out next time.